Hello, my groomer chats. So today we're going to start a new series about like some ter advanced terminology in reptiles, and like the first term we're going to introduce today is brumation. So let's get into it. So yep, guys, have you ever seen your like reptile? Is this a reptile always sleepy in the whole day and like just um yeah just uh, not eating, being lazy, sleeping, and not moving at all? So yeah, if it's your reptile, it's uh, like in winter it happens, then it's totally fine. Cause like actually, there's just like a kind of natural thing like conformation, like a a activity to allow your reptiles to conserve energy and survive during periods of cold weather or like some drought. Reptiles like including snakes, lizards, and turtles who have some periods of brumation. So next, uh, you can see this little hamster, and we're going to talk about like brumation versus hibernation. So what is the difference between brumation and hibernation? Actually, like reptiles may wake up during brumation to sometimes drink water or bask in the sun during the brumation period. However, like hibernation is like the animal will be in a state of deep sleep throughout the winter months, which they'll be like just sleeping for three months without waking up or like eating, drinking, stuff like that. Uh, like reptiles during brumation may also continue to eat, but like just lesser, while like the hibernating mammals do not eat. So you may ask, like what triggers brumation in reptiles? The first thing I found it was like temperature, if it just got too low, if there's less daylight hours, it will also slower the reptile's digestive system and like not let them digest that much so that they might also try and like brumate a bit. So yep guys, so how brumation affects your reptiles? So um yep, firstly reptiles in brumation experience slow their, their metabolism, decrease their heart rates and like reduce respiratory rate. These changes allow your reptile to like save up energy and survive for a longer period without eating or drinking. Reptiles may also like your reptiles experience changes in their body temperature and like blood chemistry during the this period. So yep, here's like a picture of a Komodo dragon having a formation, maybe. But like just yeah, that's what your reptiles will normally do. So don't be too nervous. Next. Yep. Preparing reptiles. What can you do to prepare your reptiles for brumation? I recommend you like you can reduce the temperature and light gradually, letting your pet to like reptile to like just sleep well, eat well, like drink well, and like um yeah, just monitor them sometimes for necessary like interference if it's like really not eating for like too long and like not really um like just moving then you should like check it out sometimes. But if it's still healthy, then you're good. And like, yeah, it's almost the end of the video and like here's a small attention. Reptiles might get dehydrated if they don't drink water. So make sure to like sometimes spray some water with like these bottles. And like, um, they can more be more prone to health problems such as infections or parasites if there's like bad hygiene inside the tank. So maybe having a cleanup crew like isopods will help. And like at last you should be like sometimes monitor and just check on them. But like don't over disturb them during this period and stay healthy. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you have a better understanding of brumation after watching this. And like uh, thanks you for slides go for like making this slide for template for us. And also uh, now on, there will be like daily reptile questions out every single day in our community poll. So like yeah, if you haven't checked it out, go check it out. As like there will be new questions every day and sometimes we'll be offering shout outs and like more cool features will be out soon to build up a nice reptile community. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and have a great great day Macrame Chat. Bye. <laughs>